Hi everyone, Steph here from Handbag Holic. Now, if you are anything like me, I have been striving to create the perfect coffee since lockdown. So we've been in lockdown in the UK for about eight weeks now, and I think I've mastered the perfect coffee. I've had to get a milk frother, but I have managed it. But one of the things I noticed that I was missing was my favorite designer brand logos on top, and this has been completely inspired by Instagram. Just to make my coffee extra Instagrammable, uh, I have done a coffee with a Louis Vuitton logo and a Chanel logo. I mean, why not? Now, if you'd like to try this yourself, I'm going to go through the step-by-steps now and you can download the stencils that I have created for absolutely free of charge. I will link uh, where you can download the stencil on Handbag Holic's website down below or you can press a small I in the corner and again, I will link you to the stencils. You will still need to do a little bit of work once you've downloaded them, but like I said, I'll go through that now so you can create the most perfect perfect bougie coffee. If you like designer handbags, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit the bell as well. It means lots of designer handbag amazingness will be coming your way on YouTube if you do. And don't forget to drop me a comment below, let me know how your coffee stencil turned out. So now let's take a look at what you're going to need. So first on the list is a piece of card, a printer, some scissors, a hobby knife or scalpel, a cutting mat, a milk frother and some chocolate dusting powder to go on your coffee. Okay, so step one, you need to go to the Handbagholic website. Again, the link is below or click the I in the top corner and it will link you to this page. So this is the Louis Vuitton and Chanel coffee stencil download. It's absolutely free of charge. Add one to your basket, then press view basket. You see the price is all zero. Uh, scroll down and then press proceed to checkout to finish your order. Now you will need to fill in some uh, details here. Uh, make sure you tick that you've read the terms and conditions and please leave this ticked if you would like to stay signed up to the Handbagholic newsletter and press place order. You won't need any payment information because it's free. Then you will receive an email in your inbox. Um, there will be a small note on here and um, if you would be kind enough to donate us a coffee to keep us going so we can keep creating content like this, uh, please do buy us a coffee via coffee, K-O-F-I dot com, the link's there. And then finally you can click the download link and it will take you to a Google Doc at this moment in time and then press the download button in the top right hand corner. So it's completely free and this is an A4 download. Um, it is not a physical product. So now you need to print the stencils. So here I have some card. This is 170 GSM, which isn't actually that thick, but it goes in the printer fine. You just need a single piece of this. Now print your stencils off and you can see them here. You have one logo for each size of cup. Now you want to take your scissors and start to cut these out. You don't need to do it perfectly. Um, it's just so that it makes it easier when you are doing your sprinkling. So I've just finished this Chanel logo here. This is the larger one because I have a large latte cup. I would recommend if you can to use the larger ones just because the logos are clearer and they're easier to cut out. So here we have the Chanel and Louis Vuitton logos. Now what you need to do is use a scalpel to go around the black lines. You can see that I've left a small part here otherwise the uh, part of the Chanel logo in the middle would just fall away. So I've changed the stencil for this. So once you've cut them out, make sure you do that safely with a scalpel on a rubber mat, ideally wearing gloves if needed as well. But here we have the final product. So all we have left to do now is to make our coffee and sprinkle our designer logos on top. So I'm just using an instant coffee here. So I'm just filling the cup up maybe just under halfway so that we can get all the milk in. And the milk froth has been on. So here we go, just pour the milk in and this is why you need a milk frother because if your milk isn't frothy, you aren't going to be able to sprinkle anything on top of the coffee, it will just disperse into the water. So now I'm going to take the Chanel one, so just simply hold it there and then just start to sprinkle your chocolate sprinkles on. This is definitely an art, the closer you can hold this to the top of the cup the better. 
and actually the flatter you can get the froth the better so this quick pour on the second one I did was better than the first one because it lays more flat and the logo goes onto the coffee better. So this is my second attempt with the Louis Vuitton logo again place it as close as you can to the coffee without getting it in the coffee Put your sprinkles on and I feel like my Louis Vuitton logo has come out better this time than the Chanel and I think it's down to the fact that the milk froth is flatter as you can see. So all that's left to do now is to place your designer coffee with your favourite designer bag and snap away. watching my video today on how to make an incredibly bougie coffee. Now like I said at the start of this video if you haven't already make sure you click the link below or the eye in the corner and download your Chanel and Louis Vuitton coffee stencils absolutely free of charge as my gift to you. Now if you like design handbags please don't forget to hit the subscribe button it means so much to see the community growing and definitely drop me a comment below let me know how your designer coffee is going. Now make sure you don't go anywhere because coming up next and I will link the video here for you I have pulled together the 11 best designer handbags to take with you to the workplace so now not only can you take your amazing designer coffee you can also carry the most perfect designer handbag for work so make sure you stay tuned and watch that video coming up next.